Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, Vintage Baseball Card Packs. For today's video, I'm going to be opening up two budget mystery packs. I was browsing around YouTube a couple weeks ago, and I came across this channel called Collecting on a Budget. And I saw this video where he was opening up two tins of um, 2021 Topps baseball cards. And I was checking it out, and at the end of the video, he was talking about some budget packs that he had put together. And so I checked out that video, and then I went to the website. And what this guy did is he put together budget packs of baseball, basketball, and football cards. And he did 100 of each, and each pack is only $8 a piece. So, and what he says in the pack is that there's no regular base cards in any of these cards. It's all going to be either rookie cards or parallels or numbered cards or autos or something. I went to the website and $8 and then he charges about $5 for shipping. And so what I decided to do is get two of them. So eight and eight plus $5 shipping, $21. And I get two mystery packs. So I figured what can go wrong? So let me check it out. And just the other day I got them in the mail and I thought I'd open them, open them up on the site here. So like I said, I bought these regular right off the website, so they're not special packs, and he didn't know that I'm doing a video on it or anything like that. So this is actually, you know, completely random what I get out of here. So let's see what we can get. One thing I did notice before I start opening them up is I can feel this, and this one looks like it has a slab in it. So I'm very happy about that, and this one bends over a little bit, so no slab. So let's open this one up first, number 57 out of 100, and let's see what we can get. And while I'm doing this, please be sure to click subscribe on this um, video, and later on you can leave, leave some comments after we find out what these cards look like. So um, let's open up the first pack, and let's see what we got. Nice shiny card. <laughs> and I already like the bottom card. Alex Bregman, Mosaic. Um, Chris Davis, I think it's a gold or rainbow. And I apologize, I don't know all these variations. So I think we have a gold uh, Griffin Channing. Another gold Sean Newcomb, uh, 2020s. And a Topps Chrome David Price. Uh, pink refractor, I guess. And then I don't know what this special card is, but Ryan Braun. And Corey Kluber. Is that a negative or something? And then we have Stadium Club Brendan McKay rookie card. He said at least five rookies in each pack, so there's one of them. Dustin May rookie, opening day. Nico Horner rookie. Evan White rookie. This is a Topps Chrome uh, 1952 style, I think, from this year. Sean Murphy rookie. Brendan McKay rookie. Kyle Garlick rookie card. And Sheldon Noise, Noise, rookie card. And to top it all off, a Luis Robert rookie card. Very happy about this. I'm a Luis Robert fan. And uh, Series 2 from last year. So $8. You get how many cards? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 cards for $8. So about uh, 50 cents a piece. And I think not so bad. So pretty good. So let's put this on a little stand here. Lewis Robert rookie card. Hopefully he gets better. He just got injured. And now let's move on to the second one. And like I said, this I feel like it has a slab in it. So... He put on his Instagram what all the slabs were, so I I got it. There's like six of them, I think. So and let's take a look what we can get.
I'll leave the slab in there first. Save it for the end. Sorry about this. Brendan McKay again. I think we got that in our last pack. Gavin Lux. Chrome 1985 Brendan McKay. Um, Flat Guerrero Stadium Club Chrome. Glaber Torres. Brian Anderson. Uh, select. Oh, and it's a die cut. Uh, Brown. I'm sorry, I don't know. Seth Brown. Aquino, rookie card. Yamaguchi, rookie card. And Brian Abreu, contenders rookie ticket. And it's an autograph. Look at that. Auto Brian Abreu. Zach Gallen, Chrome, rookie. Albert Alzale, rookie card. AJ Puck, Prism rookie. And Leba. Uh, just a, um, I think it's Chrome Refractor. And 2020, uh, probably 1972 card from Heritage, I think. Seth Brown, AJ Puck. Lizardo, so three, three potential prospects for the A's. Jeff McNeil, rookie card. And last, Gavin Lux Prism. So, a lot of rookies, a lot of shiny cards. I think it looks pretty good. And then, let's count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I guess it's 16 cards in a pack. And we got one auto in here. And on top of the auto, we have a PSA slab. Record breaker. Uh, 2020 tops, throwback Thursday, Jordan Alvarez. PSA Mint 9. So very cool. So I really hit it here. I think definitely this is... I don't even know how much it's worth, but it, I'm sure it's worth more than the $8 pack. So happy to add a add a graded card to my collection. So Jordan Alvarez and a pile of cards. And a Lewis Robert, all for 20 bucks. I'd say it is a definitely a good purchase. So there you go. So like I said, it's um, Collecting on a Budget, and the website is collectingonabudget.net. I just checked, and I think he's all sold out of all his packs, $8 packs. Uh, this was Series 2, so who knows, he might do a Series 3 and do another set of 100 later on. But for $8 times 2, I think I did a pretty good job. So tell me what you think, and please be sure to hit the subscribe button. So until next time, I will see you then.